Stunning vintage photos of the Italian classic beauty, Sofia. Sofia Loren, born in 1934, Rome, Italy, is an Italian film actress who rose above her poverty-stricken origins in post-war Naples to become universally recognized as one of Italy's most beautiful women and its most famous movie star. She was named by the American Film Institute as one of the greatest female stars of classical Hollywood cinema. Before working in the cinema, Sofia Sacolone changed her last name to Lazaro for work in the Fotoromancy, popular pulp magazines that used still photographs to depict romantic stories. Her first film role was as an extra, one of many slave girls in the American production of Quo Vadis, 1951, under the tutelage of producer Carlo Ponti. Her future husband, Sokolone, was transformed into Sophia Loren. Her career was launched in a series of low budget comedies before she attracted critical and popular attention with Aida, 1953, in which she lip synced the singing of Renata Tebaldi in the title role. She won 22 international awards for two women. The film was extremely well received by critics and a huge commercial success. Though proud of this accomplishment, Lauren did not show up to this award, citing fear of fainting at the award ceremony. Nevertheless, Cary Grant telephoned her in Rome the next day to inform her of the Oscar award. During the 1960s, Lauren was one of the most popular actresses in the world and continued to make films in the United States and Europe, starring with prominent leading men. In 1964, her career reached its pinnacle when she received $1 million to appear in the fall of the Roman Empire. In 1965, she received a second Academy Award nomination for her performance in Marriage Italian Style opposite Marcello Mastroianni. Beginning at the start of the 1980s, Lauren chose to make rarer film appearances. Since then, she has appeared in films such as Pret a Porter, 1994, Grumpier Old Men, 1995, and 9, 2009. Lauren first met Ponti in 1950, when she was 15 and he was 37. Though Ponti had been long separated from his first wife, Giuliana, he was not legally divorced when Lauren married him by proxy. Two male lawyers stood in for them, in Mexico on September 17, 1957. The couple had their marriage annulled in 1962 to escape bigamy charges, but continued to live together. In 1965, they became French citizens after their application was approved by then French Prime Minister Georges Papidou. Ponti then obtained a divorce from Giuliana in France, allowing him to marry Lauren on April 9, 1966. They had two children, Carlo Ponti Jr., born on December 29, 1968, and Eduardo Ponti, born on January 6, 1973. Lauren's daughters-in-law are Sasha Alexander and Andrea Mazaros. Lauren has four grandchildren. Lauren remained married to Carlo Ponti until his death on January 10, 2007 from pulmonary complications. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel.